Good morning, good morning to you all. I pray that you had a restful sleep on last night. I pray that you're here, hallelujah, to give God your first fruit. I pray in the name of Jesus that you will be able, hallelujah, to get every nugget that God has for us on this morning. We're going to go ahead and go into commanding our morning, day 90. Our thought for today is, attract the attention of angels. Glory to your name, God. Attract the attention of angels. Guys, we should have faith as size of a mustard seed that will attract angels daily in our life. In the name of Jesus, we should, hallelujah, call on them for help throughout to the day. Because that's why they are there. They are there to assist us. They are there to manifest things into the earth for us. Hallelujah. That we're praying for. That we are, you know, have the faith for. That we are trying to bring forth through God. In Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Glory to your name, God. So we're going to go on in to commanding our day, our morning, day 90. Okay. It says, do you think that I cannot appeal to my father? And he will at once, thank you, Jesus, send me more than 12 legions of angels. My God, can you imagine we are living a life that God called us to live and that we are doing it faithfully and we're doing it on purpose and we're doing it because it's our heart to do it. And that when we need help, can you imagine that he sends 12 legions of angels to help us 12 legions oh my god can you can your mind phantom what 12 legions of angels are hallelujah glory to your name god so that means they are all around us guys they're here to protect us they're here to guide us they're here to show us the way in the name of jesus and we should release them in our life on a daily in Jesus name okay so we're gonna go further on in on day 90 thank you Jesus fallen angels cause deviations to what God originally purposed they operate much like the heavenly angels assigned to bring about the manifestation to your prayers only in the exact opposite way Glory to your name, God. When they fall from heaven, their mission became perverted. So instead of being, and so instead of bringing answers, they prohibit answers from manifesting. Your faith attracts the attention of heavenly angels. Hallelujah. Glory to your name, God to work in your behalf while your fear draws the demons of hell to work against you. Glory to your name, God. Did y'all get that nugget? Why your fear? So are we walking around here fearing about this situation we're going through right now with Corona? We're panicking. We're fearing. We're afraid of this. We're afraid of that. We, we're, we're acting as if God is not God. So when you, we do this, let's think on this thing. So when we find ourselves doing this, let's remind ourselves that it says, God's word says, hallelujah, that your fear draws the demons, hallelujah, of hell to work against you. Glory to your name, God. So let's just remember that when we're starting to fear. That we open that door for him to come in out of hell to work against us. Hallelujah to your name, God. Thank you, Jesus. He come to make that thing that you're fearful about a reality. Glory to your name, God. Your words become the magnet that draws either heaven or hell. Your words becomes a magnet that will draw heaven or hell glory to your name god thank you jesus hallelujah glory into your situation your words will hallelujah become the magnet that draws either heaven or hell into your situation 
Thank you, God. But always remember, no force is more powerful than the spoken word of God. Always remember, no force is more powerful than the spoken word of God. Glory to your name, Jesus. This is why I do what I do. This is why I pray every day. This is why I'm here for you all every day. And I pray that you join me. And I pray that you grow. And I pray that you get closer to God. And I pray that every situation that came to hold you back, every angel that's not like a heavenly, heavenly angel, hallelujah, that it be stopped at a screeching halt in the name of Jesus. That fear will not rest in your life. That fear will not rest in your thinking. That fear will not ride with you home. That fear will not be at your home. Hallelujah. Glory to your name, God. That fear will not have its way in your life. Glory to your name, God. I thank you for it. In the name of Jesus. Glory to your name, God. That fear will not ride your back. That fear will not enter into your children. Hallelujah. But fear will be, hallelujah, demolished and put away. Hallelujah. And it shall not, hallelujah, have reign in our lives in the name of Jesus. Glory to your name, God. I thank you. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus, God, forgive my phone for ringing out. Hallelujah. Glory to your name, God. It's just a distraction. Just know that. It's a distraction. The enemy did not want you to hear what God is saying. Fear not. Hallelujah. But acknowledge him in all of your ways. Accept him as your Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Confess it with your mouth and believe it in your heart that he is Lord. And you call on heavenly angels that fear will not reign. Hallelujah. It will not ride with you home. It will not reign in your children's life. It will not reign in your spouse's life. It will not reign in your children's life. It will not ride with you in the car. It will not go home with you and talk to you and tell you. Hallelujah. And speak to you in the name of Jesus. But you, hallelujah, you tell fear, hallelujah, that it has no room. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And you have come into the acknowledgement of Jesus Christ and you have faith over fear. Hallelujah. And fear, you have to eat God's power, force, hallelujah, anointed word in the name of Jesus. Glory to your name, God. Hallelujah. Glory to your name, God. Now, Father, guys, we're going to go ahead on into prayer. Hallelujah for today. Okay. Because I know we got things to do. Hallelujah. And time just go by so fast these days. Thank you, God. Hallelujah. It says, Lord, you give your angels charge over me to keep me in all my ways. Satan comes only to steal, kill, and destroy. Understand that. Satan only comes to steal, kill, and destroy. Hallelujah. And he's been doing it for years. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. But you have come that I may have life and that more abundantly i will not play into the enemy's hands by giving place to fear and anxiety hallelujah glory to your name god yes yeah, so that's why you you know you feel like you may be hyperventilating sometimes your heart going fast and you know you just antsy because fear and anxieties are best friends they marry they come together they work together in the name of jesus so you have to destroy them together hallelujah glory to your name by the root hallelujah glory to your name god i will proclaim your word hallelujah that's what we have to do we have to come com com we have to hallelujah say god's word see he don't even want me to say the words we have to proclaim god's word Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus, we have to speak it out of our mouth and believe it in our heart and watch that thing manifest and come to pass. In the name of Jesus, glory to your name. I will proclaim your word because your angels respond to your word. Hallelujah. According to Hallelujah, Psalms 34 and 7, let your angels encamp around about me now and lord deliver me in jesus name 
Amen. Let's thank God for delivering us from the spirit of fear and anxiety. Let's thank God, hallelujah, for helping us, hallelujah, to come out of negative to positive. Let's thank God for the new heart. Let's thank God for the spiritual eyes and ears, hallelujah, in the mighty name of Jesus. Glory to your name, God. God, thank you for deliverance on today. Thank you for setting us free from ourselves, from our own stinking thinking and our own stinking ways. Hallelujah. That has also gotten us into a, a, a dump. Hallelujah. Somewhere that you, God did not intend us to be. Glory to your name. Oh, he didn't allow or want someone to put us there either. In the name of Jesus. Father, I come to you right now. In the name of Jesus. I thank you for keeping us. I thank you for your word on today. I thank you, hallelujah, for fear and anxiety is destroyed from the root on today out of our lives. In the name of Jesus. It will have no more room from this day forth. In the mighty name of Jesus. Thank you for transforming our mind. Thank you for giving us a spiritual eye and ear. Thank you for giving us a mouth, hallelujah, to speak on your word, the forces and the power and the anointing, hallelujah, yoke breaking of your word in the mighty name of Jesus. Glory to your name, God. I thank you for keeping our families, keeping our children, keeping our spouses, keeping our jobs, hallelujah, so that we are have a way to make it in this world physically. But God, we know that you are our, our, our source and that you will supply everything that we ever need, even if the job let us down. In the name of Jesus, God, we thank you right now. We thank you for giving us a resource because that's a blessing to have that you said a man won't work, won't eat in Jesus' name. So God, we thank you for giving us the mind to work. Hallelujah. In the mighty name of Jesus. God, I thank you right now for pouring your blood from the crown of our head to the sole of our feet, God. Cover us and keep us, God. Any, any sickness, God, I thank you for healing. I thank you, hallelujah, for taking every pain, body racking pain, mental, hallelujah, physical, and seen and unseen, God. Deliverance, set us free right now in Jesus' name. Every yoke-breaking curse that has been taught upon us, been spoke upon us, been generational in the name of Jesus. I thank you for your release of your anointing, your power, and your order in the name of Jesus and your righteousness. Hallelujah. That everything shall line up with the word of God. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Guys, y'all have a blessed day. No God is hearing every prayer. Hallelujah. He hears your petitions. So just give him your life and allow him to be God in your life. Hallelujah. And see the great and the wonderful blessings that he has for you. And just see where he's going to take you in Jesus' name. Amen.